guys, it's Animal Colors and today's video is going to be how to know if your bunny loves you and what to do to make your bunny love you. So let's talk about if your bunny loves you. The way you are sure that your bunny loves you is the first step is that your bunny is not afraid of you. It's not afraid to come to you and maybe go around you. And when your bunny is in the cage, when you come into the room, your bunny won't automatically go into its hidey house or go away. Some other things are your bunny will chin you and basically it's a when your bunny just goes and basically rubs its chin on your leg or maybe on anything like that. And basically, that's the way they mark their territory. The way is when your bunny licks or nipples you, and I mentioned this in a past video, and basically your bunny will go around you and lick you on the leg or maybe anywhere, and it will nibble on you if you have a new bunny and it doesn't know that it's not supposed to nibble on you. Also, they will go around you in circles, uh, walk around your legs, run around you. If you, I like to lie on the floor sometimes, and as um, and Kiwi will just run around me and lick me. You may notice is banking, and it's basically when your bunny is running around your house or your room and like jumping, ears flopping around, and it's really really cute, and it's showing that your bunny's happy. Also, another thing is lying down and chilling out. It's when your bunny just lies near you and like stretches its legs out and tummy it lies on its tummy and just stress when it's done running around it's something that happens when your bunny trusts you and is not afraid to be near you what should you do to make your bunny love you or just basically get used to you first step is try talking to it even if it's out of the cage or in the cage doesn't matter you can read out loud you could just talk to it i love talking to kiwi let your bunny sniff your hand and take treats from your hand and make sure your bunny knows that you won't hurt it. Another thing is put toys in its cage uh, for development and just to make their life fun when you're out at school or work, it doesn't matter, just put the toys in its cage. Handle your bunny well is a very important part. You have to handle your bunny well. Don't hold it by ears, never hold your bunny by ears. Also don't hold your bunny like this by here because some, some people like to hold your bunny by here and like pull them up, don't do that. Beep, beep, beep. And this is basically how you pick up your rabbit by butt and on here. But don't try to pick up your rabbit a lot because they don't like to be picked up. Just pet it. The other thing that you might want to do is let your bunny out a lot out of its cage so it may get used to you and to environment. Make sure your bunny area where you let it out is bunny proof so no cords, no, uh, like I wouldn't suggest be having carpet because it can pee if your bunny is not a litter train. Kiwi is fully litter trained so basically if she wants to go to the bathroom she comes back into her cage. Spend a lot of time with your bunny because it's very important. Pet it, give it treats, just hang out with it. And I mean this all comes to the same part, just hang out and be nice to your bunny. And here's some tips uh, to follow if uh, to make your bonding with your rabbit more like clear. Another thing is never punish your rabbit. Don't beat it. Don't scream at it. Bunnies don't understand it, but they will be scared of you if you do that. Not dogs, and they are not cuddly things. They don't like to be held. They don't like to be even petted sometimes. They like to be petted some bunnies. I mean, my fast bunnies love to be petted. If it nips you, and if you actually don't want your bunny to nip you, just make a high-pitched noise like Approach your bunny slowly, never too fast, and never from the back. The many bunnies like to be petted on the head, but don't pet it on the back because that's not like dogs. Have a big cage for your bunny because um, your bunnies I need a big cage. <laughs> Make sure your bunny has a hiding house, and this is really, really important. If your bunny is scared, they will become aggressive if they don't have a hiding house. Right, so I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope it helped at least a little bit. So don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and uh, share it or write a comment if this any of this helped or if you have any suggestions on how to make sure your bunny loves you or anything you want to add to this video, you can feel free to comment down below. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys later. Have a colorful day. Goodbye.